Hey guys, um, a lot of you have these five sifting trays that go in a bucket. I actually bought a sixth one, which is the one thirtieth size, and I want to explain to you why it's so important for collecting frets. If you get the five piece set, you get this top size, which is I think a, a half, and the second one, which is a quarter, third one is one eighth, and then one twelfth, and then one twentieth. Those are usually the five that people get. Um, the one twentieth is pretty good at catching all your worms and letting most of your frass go through. Um, but I'm noticing that some of your brand goes through as well, meaning your frass isn't pure frass. So let's take a look. I've already sifted this tray right here through all four of these top layers. So here's where all of your good substrate still sits. Okay. Um, this is your 120th tray. This would have caught everything except for your frass. But below that is a 130th tray. Now it looks like frass. I just saw a couple baby worms in there. Um, but if you feel it, it's not as gritty as Frass's. It still feels soft like Bran does. And if you look in, that's actual Bran. It's a completely different uh, texture. Bran is gritty. Sorry, Frass is gritty. Bran is still kind of soft. This Bran has definitely been broken down since its original form, but it's still edible. So, I recommend purchasing one extra tray, which this is this one right here, the 130th size, because all of this brand is going to waste if you let it fall into your craft bucket. Okay. Instead, this brand is reusable, it'll eventually turn to frass. Just add it right back into your worms. Oh,